Hey everyone, welcome to Figure Fantasy. Again, we're going to be looking at Tia's um, evaluation and rating. And let's take a look at how she does. A lot of hype has been developed around Tia. Um, I've covered her quite a while, discussed her kit for quite a while already. And uh, let's uh, go back to what makes her good. So definitely... You guys know that she's good already, but again, let's do a recap of how good she is. So, um, Tia gives various buffs to allies during secret technique. Probability of the secret technique power increases in the case of Pegasus. Energy and HP recovery damage reduction increases durability. So, she is a defender, a tank, with a lot of buffs to herself. Okay, so... She's going to be very good uh, addition for Tenma. Um, eventually, we're going to be replacing Crusus with her. So let's check her out. So attack skill is going to be range 1. Attack speed is fast. Prioritize the attacking foremost. And it's the usual um, uh, level up effect. Uh, it's going to be a plus 50%. Her technique skill or her ultimate initial energy is zero this might have been you know wrong in the encoding but her skill is attack the current target dealing heavy damage level up effect increases the mystery or the ultimate damage by 36 gives a protective effect to allied figures in the start of the battle when or when the mystery is activated so activation of uh, ultimate and also uh the start of the battle she is going to be uh, giving a protective effect to all allied figures and reduces the next damage received by 50%. So that's a lot. It, it's not a self buff, actually. It's a buff to all allies. The damage reduction is huge by 50%. So, level up the other one is when an ally, when I tell my ally figure activates a, a secret technique or their ultimate. There is a 50% chance that Tia's secret technique power will increase by 30%. Which is not bad. Stacking up to 3 times disappears when the mystery is activated or her ultimate. Again, this, this ultimate alone is good. It's a very good protective buff. It has a lot. It has damage reduction. It has protective effects. And it revolves around... It revolves towards her um technique increase 30 percent so the secret technique i think this is going to be her ultimate so it revolves around her ultimate basically so passive is at the start of the battle um, tia will be in a strengthened state and when an ally figure activates a secret technique it will recover and acquire 25 energy so for every time your allies do an ultimate she there's a possibility that she's she will recover it will recover and acquire 25 energy so this is not conditional this is going to happen whenever your allies do a ultimate so recovers energy also reduces damage taken by 16 percent for five for five seconds stacking up to 14 times so 16 times four that's roughly what 64 so, so that's big that's big level up effect in the inhibition of behavior is disabled treatment effect is increased by 28 gain two damage reduction at the start of combat so specialized skills so 25 chance to reduce damage taken by 50 percent when attack degrees on critical damage and defense by 10 and 35 percent chance to reduce damage taken by 50 percent when attacked so again she has a lot of damage reduction she has buffs protective buffs for her team what can you ask for in a defender she's top tier she's 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 s tier guys you have to summon for her uh, there's no other way there's no other excuse that you can't summon for her Again, she's going to check all boxes. She's rated a 9.7 out of a 10. Uh, you'll regret it if you don't summon for her. So please make sure that you do summon for this android. She's, she's actually an android. So again, a lot of things going 
for her as a defender probably one of our top defenders when she comes out and this is who she loves to work with Vivian, Erhans, uh, Mako, Zephyr, and Sunny. And also for her skin. So she has this skin. Uh, I've seen this before. And she has the this one. This is a new one. So this is, I think, an MVP skin. So that is it, guys. Again, she's a must someone. I tell you, she needs to be on your roster as soon as possible. As soon as this figure drops, you need to have her. You need to level her up. You need to get her to five diamonds if possible. So again, guys, what can I say? So thank you very much for staying this far. I will put a link for this um, this uh, website that I've referenced in the description. So take care. Stay safe. This is the Warden, and I'm out of here.